Hello everyone, my name is Apple Guy, and welcome back to another Minecraft horror map. Today we are playing a map called Friend, spelled F dot R dot I dot E dot N dot D, like it's an acronym. Uh, this is a, something about living in a forest, I think. We're gonna start it. Friend, a horror adventure. Oh boy, it's preparing the game. Don't worry guys, it's preparing the game. Okay, that was a weird dream. Oh, the music's on. Wait, why is it dark outside? Did I oversleep? I gotta turn the music off. Hold on, give me a sec. There we go. Uh, strange, the clock says it's 9.23 a.m. But why is it still dark outside then? That makes no sense at all. Perhaps I should eat something first. I would think that's a good idea. Also, with RTX lowering my FOV, it's like I have no thumb at all. Oh, no thumb, no finger at all. Finger. Fist. What am I talking about? Boy, I am out of it today, aren't I? Where is a kitchen around here? I should turn on the lights first. Good idea. All the lights? This is what I do when I go home. Much better. I should go watch the news now. Perhaps I know anything of what's happening with the time. Friends? Who the heck said that? Who's out there? I should go check on outside. Perhaps someone is just trolling me? Objective. Go look if someone is outside. That is not the name of the map. The map's called Friend, not Outside. Hello, is anyone out there? Do not feed the fish. Okay, this is getting odd. Really odd. I should find out what's going on here. Wanna be friends? They came from the bathroom. I should go check it out. Go to the bathroom. This is a crazy map. Hold on, let me show something real quick. So if I turn RTX off, you see I get my hand back. But because RTX like changes the FOV, our, our hand is like six pixels. Is this the bathroom? This is the bathroom. Nobody again? Is my mind playing tricks on me? And the person, the, the friend goes, blah, 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 blah. Where the heck am I? Long, endless hallway. I don't see any movement detectors. How did the light go on? Magic. You know, oh lord. That's not funny. How'd that scare me, man? I'm usually good with jump scares. Usually... No, it doesn't do squat for me. That's a shame. Uh, light is your friend. Darkness is mine. Cool. Glad that we have opposite friends. Oh. Oh, this is... I always like these sorts of scenes where the lights go out. It is, it's not as great with RTX because RTX fades the light out instead of a... Uh, no, making it an instant. But I like the idea. Is the one above me gonna go out? Or no? Should I go back? Oh, there it is. Should I walk back? No. Oh. Oh, now it's dark. Where am I this time? Wanna be friends? Please get out of my head, whoever you are. I'm Bob. I need friends. Wanna be friends? Get out of my head! I like- isn't this just- Oh, this could honestly- This could be the thumbnail. Oh, I love RTX. I could stare at that forever. Okay, there's a door though, here's the door. Alright. Me and my tiny fist will punch the door open. Uh, good adventurers always go left. So we're gonna go left. What does the right look like though? By the way, apparently this map has a- A, a normal ending, and a secret ending. So, I don't know if I'm going to, like, hunt for the secret ending, but apparently one exists. Oh, help! By me! Let's go ahead and back into a corner and read it. I need friends. Please. Blah, 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 blah. And pages two and four were blank. I wrote that, apparently. Am I Bob? Also, you really named your enemy Bob? Skeleton head? Two skeleton heads and a human head. Very odd. Gotta be on the lookout for those heads. I'll go through that door in just a second. I want to investigate this door first. A wither skeleton skull. A skeleton head. Shout out if anyone gets that reference. That one's a bit on the obscure side, so probably not. Um, yeah. No worries though. Oh, head in a little 
circle. Okay, that's disturbing. I need to get out of here. And fast. Okay, there's a door here. A little hard to see with the RTX, but that's fine. Nothing adds to the horror ambience like pitch blackness. Okay, hold on. I gotta toggle it. Yeah, I can't see anything. Here we go. Okay. Uh, another book called Diary by Bob. Oh, actually, I threw it on the floor. Can I turn the RTX back on, though? Will I be able to see? I can see clear enough, I think. Uh, February 4th, 2005. Today, it is my birthday. But as always, I don't have any friends to celebrate with. I never had any, nor will I ever have one. I hate my life. Everyone on this planet probably hates me, even my mom and dad. March 2nd of the same year, 2005. I did not feel like writing. I did not feel like writing for quite a while. Boy, have I been there. Actually, let's do a live check. Let's do a live check. The last time I wrote something in my journal, just pulled it out of the little book cupboard. We're going to flip through the pages. Uh, oh, it was, uh, oh, the 3rd of November, actually. So like, like a month ago. That's not bad. Before that, it was the 18th of September. So intermittent. All that just to say, I'm with you, Bob. I did not feel like writing for quite a while. I had some really bad days. Those two stupid guys, they bullied me once again. I don't want to say it to anyone. Everyone will probably laugh at me. I hate them. I hate them. I hate them. Fair. Uh, March 7th of 2005. Uh, I knew it. Everyone laughed at me. The whole school. Someone drawed me on the whiteboard with the text, Bob is a loser. I hate them. They said I don't belong in the school. I did not have that. I did not believe that for years, but now I think they were right all along. I'm suck. April 17th, 2005. I'm not sure about my life anymore. Everyone hates me. I'm planning to leave everyone behind soon. The school that my parents, literally everyone. Guess I will go hide in a forest or something. I won't bother anyone there. Animals do not hate me. Hello, diary. I just want to say that I am stronger now. Much stronger. Now I am able to get revenge. Everyone who ever bothered me will die, and I'll start with those high school bullies. Then I'll see who I'm going to kill. May they suffer. Forever. Blah, 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 for two pages. Well, Bob, thanks for... Thanks for sharing that insight with the class. I appreciate it. Uh, become friends. Is this the secret ending? Uh, we'll say yes. Finally, a friend. Oh, Ugh, where am I? What am I doing here? Well, since you are the only friend I've ever had, I need you to stay here forever. You're joking, right? This is not how you treat friends. You can't do that. I see there's a trap door over here. I'm going to drop through it at some point. I'm sorry, Apple guy. I have no other choice. Objective, look for a way out, unless you want to stay here forever. It's through here. And then I can sneak through here. And I can go out up here. Nice. After this is over, I'll go back and click the no option just to see what happens. Uh, testing cell security cameras. I think I see a hidden chest here. Uh, read me from unknown. Oh boy, the subject has been in a coma for years. It was brought here by someone. I did not ask for his name, neither the other scientists did. The person said he found them somewhere in a forest unconscious and that he brought them here right after. According to him, a hospital cannot help the subject. At first thought, I thought he was crazy. But soon we already understood why. The man left. We started to do some tests on the subject. It screamed a name. Bob or something. Yeah, really hard to pick up on that one. Three letters. I'm not sure too sure of it though, since it was a little unclear. Then, how do you mumble Bob, like, Bob, and then just, like, three hours later, Buh? I don't know. Uh, then something happened. After eight hours since the strange man brought us, the subject, it woke up. It was not a human being. It felt like a zombie was walking in our lab. Once again, I screamed a lot. Three minutes later, the subject was in a coma again. We had to put them in our special cell. The subject was too dangerous to be in our lab. However, five years later, we had to evacuate. I did not know why, at least, not on the moment when I was writing this message. We had to leave the separate behind. They are probably dead now, since we could not bring any food to them anymore. There might still be a chance that, they, that the subject is alive though, but the odds are too small. If you are reading this message, I am already dead. If you are the subject, please know that at least five years have passed already. Run to the exit as soon as possible. This place is not safe anymore. 
Okay, so I guess that's referring to us. We are the, uh, the subject. I guess. Okay, run to the exit. I have slowness, so I will... I will saunter to the exit. It's locked. I need to find another way out. Control room. To play Five Nights at Freddy's. Like all the lovers, I guess. Unlock research room one. Okay, darn door. Uh, which one was research one? Research one, right here. Oh my gosh. Oh my. They keep humans in here like this? That is insane. That is insane. A vent. I need to crawl in it to reach the other side. All right, here I go. How do I get through the vent? Oh, I'm blind now. Close your eyes. You can't see anything. We made it through. And the light is flickering. Okay, that, that did something. A secret room? Wait, did I just see 666 somewhere? Oh, yeah, I did. Research room number 666. Oh, it's through here. Why did you leave the cell? Don't you want to be my friend? And then it says die about a trillion billion times. What the heck? What the heck, guys? Oh, shoot. I'm trapped here. That's actually kind of a shame. Oh, can't see anything. Blind again. Why did you leave the cell? Don't you want to be my friend? Huh? Where did all those signs go? They, they despawn. Also, I hear a fire. Or rain. I think it's fire. It's fire. Oh, door. Perfect. This is it. This is your end. Goodbye. No! It'd actually be kind of cool if the fire would spread. Should I... Should I... Oh, I can't. I can't step into the fire. Oh. Oh, turning me around? I'm not doing this. Hey, it's Bob again. How's it going, Bob? Oh, gosh. This is your end. <laughs> Goodbye, Apple guy. No! We got godded. I guess. The end. Wow, great job. Uh, oh, we got the bad ending. There's three endings. There's the bad ending, the good ending, and the secret ending. Please try again and find a button. I need to blah blah blah. Oh, okay, so it's find the button. By the way, spectator mode is out now. That's sweet. Okay, so it's find the button is how you get the good ending, I guess, or a different ending. Um, did I do a maze? Oh, shoot. Oh, uh, where in the world am I? Whoops, I didn't mean to trigger that. E yeah, I got the bad ending. Oh, great, a maze. I need to get out of here fast. That's crazy. I didn't even know there was a maze in this map. Huh. I was gonna go back. There's parkour too? Wait, so I actually... I did really bad then. Holy buckets. Should I have said no to wanting to be its friend? Okay, hold on. Wait. I want to try... What if I say... No. You will die. Oh, so it spawns me here. You could have been my friend, Apple guy. I need to go on an adventure. But now it's too late. You're gonna die. Goodbye, Apple guy. Oh, now you go into the maze. Okay. Uh, let's try it. Honestly, kind of glad I got the bad ending because I hate mazes in Minecraft maps. And this would have sent me over the edge. So, it's almost a good thing. It says coward. Almost a good thing. Yeah, I, I don't... <laughs> There's two things on my uh, YouTube channel that I always complain about for um, Minecraft maps. One of them is fake loading screens. Hate fake loading screens. The other one is mazes. I don't like a maze. I think mazes are ways for map makers to make the maps seem longer than they are. Because a maze is easy to build and it doesn't really add much to 
the story or the overarching themes or anything like that. I solved it though. I'm 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 through the maze. This is the end of the maze. We did it. We made it through the maze. That was tricky, guys. Um, and then I think you just go this way. Right. Right. Okay, now it's dark. There's a door. I'm back home. Honey, I'm home. Oh. Darn it. Smacked upside the head. What the heck just happened? I'm gonna keep turning the lights on. Uh-huh. This is... I kind of... What's a little weird is like... It seems that if you go... The bad ending route... You get sent to a... a like a lab testing facility... And the good ending, I'll put the light switch, but it, it does not seem to work. Shoot. If you get the bad ending, you go to a testing facility. If you go to the good ending, you're like... Looping. I hope it's not a, a looping hallway. That just showed me a small window, or a small door. And I got conked out again. Now it's further back. I bet I'm gonna get hit again. Even further back? Even further back? And hit again? Very cool. I don't know why these aren't instant, by the way. I don't know why I have to teleport to the black room for- Oh! It's him! It's Bob! Surely this isn't the good ending. Right? Oh, thank heavens. What the heck is going on here? Dude, my question's exactly, man. Like, what the heck is going on here? What is this supposed to be? Oh, I guess this used to be a bedroom. We can hide over here. He'll never find us. He'll never find us. Speak. Oh, a new room. A storage room next to a bedroom? That makes no sense. Yeah, whoever's heard of a closet? A summoning... Shoot. I put the summoning block on the wrong place. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna... Just copy this from creative mode. There we go. Okay, gonna go into survival. And not hold these. Okay, good. I only have to check the lower chest, it looks like. Um, because the top ones are blocked. I'm assuming I'm gonna find candles. Candles, candles, candles. I'm glad I didn't have to play through the whole map a second time. That I could just like teleport myself to the this part. It would be nice if it was like an option though. Because a lot of times when you beat like a real game, they'll give you like new game plus that lets you um that lets you like uh teleport right to like critical moments. Like Detroit Become Human does that for sure. You can just go like chapter by chapter. Um being able to do that in this game would be kind of cool. Um hey, a note to anyone who's reading this, you're currently in one of Bob's pocket dimensions. There is a way to escape and defeat him. You need to find the four candles and the special summoning block. They're hidden in the other chest. Once you've found them all, head back to the bedroom. There you can find an unfinished portal. Place the candles on the red summoning blocks and the special summoning block on the yellow block. If you do everything right, Bob will be taken back to the underworld. It says good luck. Shoot. Shoot. I'm going into creative mode. Boom. Boom. Okay. And then this here, this here. Wait for the ritual to end. What are you doing? Stop it! No, this can't be true! No one has ever defeated me! Mark my words, Apple Guy. Mark my words! I will come back. This is not over yet. I just stood in, in here for like... 30 seconds, 45 seconds. I'm feeling sleepy. Oh, looks like I'm home again. Let's hope I never get into a situation like that ever again. Hey, good ending. Cool. Alright, I think I'm going to wrap up there. I don't really want to go for the secret ending, because it said you have to, like, find a button. Uh, but that was a cool map. I had a pretty good time playing that. I'll link to the map in the description if you want to play it, find the secret ending, all that sort of stuff. Um, yeah, usually I have, like, suggestions for how to improve the map. Um, 
maybe like response time just the fact that like some commands would take a while to run but otherwise you know i had a good time that is going to be all for now though ladies and gentlemen i want to thank you all so so much for watching if you have enjoyed please hit like and subscribe and tell your friends about my channel if you think they would enjoy it it means a lot to me when you guys spread my videos around and i'll catch you guys all back here next time for my next video until then as always take care <laughs>